what is going on you guys and welcome back to another video and in today's video we are going to be reacting to the announced trailer that was officially released two days ago i was going to make this video on the day it was re-uploaded uploaded you mean hmm? yes yoda everyone knew what i meant anyways but i was quite busy and i was going to do a reaction like this yesterday but i forgot to but now is the time to make a video like this just to get it out of the way. And finally, Star Wars Battlefront, the classic collection, is getting ported on the new gen consoles. And let me tell you this, I used to play Star Wars Battlefront a lot, but the one I played was the second one. I used to play it a lot. I was addicted to it. I used to have so much fun on that, playing it on the PlayStation and the original Xbox. Well, PlayStation 2, of course. And, and ever since this is getting ported, my guess that when it releases, I'm going to be addicted to it again. But hopefully not. And I'm also excited for this to release is because we might be getting trophies and achievements. Well, trophies slash achieve achievements, I would say. And hopefully they will be easy to unlock all the achievements. So, ladies and gentlemen, I am now going to be reacting to the trailer and then I will give my overall thoughts and then I will be pausing on the way as well. Well, as I'm watching this video, reacting to it, I'll be pausing on the way. So sit back, relax and enjoy. Your simulation days are over, Trooper. This is a real battle. No retreat. And also, my guess is that the HD graphics are getting remastered as well. Form up. No excuses. Now get out there. Fight your way across the Star Wars game. Okay, let me tell you something about this. Moss Eisley on Assault. I used to play this hell of a lot. But originally, this would have been called Heroes vs. Villains. Well, in the EA Battlefront games... This is heroes versus villains, but in the classics, they call this assault. We are across the Star Wars galaxy in the classic Battlefront games with massive 64 player online battles. Hopefully this game doesn't become a sweat show. I wouldn't mind if this was on cross platform, but, but let's just hope that skill based matchmaking doesn't really ruin this game because this is something that we don't need because casual players just need to have fun playing this game because as for myself, I'm a casual player. Skill issue you have, hmm? No, I don't, Yoda. And says the one who defends skill-based matchmaking like a fanboy. And split-screen local gameplay. Fight with heroes. Never tell me the odds. And battle with villains. Bring me more Jedi! I hope that the campaign on this game, well, on Battlefront 2, will have achievements. Because if that, I will definitely be looking forward to playing this game. I haven't pre-ordered this game anyway, or yet. We haven't, I haven't pre-ordered it just yet. Get ready for the Star Wars Battlefront Classic Collection. Launching March 14th. Pre-order now. My overall review on the Battlefront Classic Collection. This definitely looks so exciting and I thought it was quite decent as well. So definitely looking forward to playing this game again as this was my childhood. Even though I did play the first Battlefront but not as much as Battlefront 2. So I will be looking forward to playing this game and I will be on it and I hopefully will get all the achievements on it. But you never know. They might make the hardest achievements, but no matter if they do. But anyways, that'll be it for the, today's video. Hope you've enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys next time. Have a great day and night to you all. Peace out. Underwater.